fans. Big fans. Hello YouTube, plain and simple. Today we're going to look at how we get from that to that. That is another jet engine, but a turbo fan. Turbo comes from the part of the engine which is the turbine that's, that's to say that it is a turbine uh, jet engine the fan part refers to this thing that fan that big hunk of spinning metal um, let's start over there all right and we're here this engine is gonna look familiar or should this is the very first engine from the first video of this channel this is a pure turbo jet again turbo for turbine jet engine uh, and jet well and then you get the jet part that's what goes out the back but notice that this has a compressor combustors turbine exhaust and nothing else all of the air that goes in the front goes out the back all of that airflow goes through the combustors not all of the air gets burnt but all of it goes through the combustors most of it in fact most of it is used for cooling that so we don't melt the turbines uh, but all of the air that goes in the front through the compressor goes through the entire engine which is not the case for these guys we'll get to that in a minute in the beginning of turbo jet engines uh, technology was evolving evolving getting better and better these engines got more and more efficient higher and higher compression ratios more power for the same weight more efficient it got to the point that the exhaust was so fast it was supersonic it was super loud and not it was that's the uh, that's a good thing for very fast supersonic airplanes but not so good for heavy uh, bigger and heavier airplanes that are moving a lot more mass but going a lot slower in that case you're better off taking some of the engine of that super fast jet exhaust taking adding one more remember from the first video what the point of the turbines was the point of the turbines is to steal some of the power from the exhaust stream take some of that power to drive the compressor well imagine if you had imagine if you had this engine producing so much power that it had plenty of power left over where you could add one more turbine behind it right back there connected to a fan in the front a big great big fan in the front now that fan, that last turbine, that additional uh, newly added turbine, could be dedicated solely to drive a bigger fan up here, which now would move a lot more volume of air around bypassing the engine. This would be encased, and now you would have a duct all around it, driving a lot more air, pushing a, moving a lot more mass of air, but at a slower speed that's what that thing is this thing here I believe this is a CF6 anyways big turbofan engine has a big fan in the front inside of here inside of here basically what you have is this this turbojet now became the core of a turbofan so inside of here you have the traditional turbojet engine with the intake compressor diffuser the, the combustor turbines and whatever but behind all that is an additional turbine which has a shaft running through the center of the engine to drive the fan that is how we get from a turbojet to a turbofan and now we're back over here you can see how if you compare the size of that fan 
that moves a hell of a lot more ma heavier massive air back not as fast but it moves a lot more mass than just a turbojet it, uh, alone would otherwise on its own the turbine the additional turbine or turbines because this is several stages in this case all the way in the back of the engine are only there to drive this fan the the fan and the last turbines are not mechanically connected to the engine core the engine core spins on its own it's its own standalone engine per se but the exhaust of that core drive the the additional turbines which in turn drive this and that's how we get from a pure turbojet to a turbofan and modern engines the core the core of the engine is getting more and more efficient and smaller and lighter and these fans are only getting bigger and bigger and more efficient and that's has been the progression so far on turbofan engines so there you go it's a quick view of how we get from again turbojet to turbofans <laughs>